If you're looking to build a free funnel that looks like a link tree but still collects emails, stick around and I'll show you how. So first things first, go and open your funnel. You can see here this was a pre-made funnel and it's got a lot of extras that we don't really want. So we're going to delete all the extra things out. Once we've deleted all the extra sections, we're just going to copy the button that's already there and use it for simplicity. To copy the button, hit this button right here. And you can make as many copies as you want. So we're going to pretend we have four links that we want to share. Now because we have four different links, we're going to go up here to where it says pop-ups. And we're going to create four different pop-ups. I've created four pop-ups. So first thing I'm going to do is close this screen. And I'm going to go into, and we're just going to do one pop-up and then you can just repeat the process for the others. We're going to go to the gear. And over here on the side, it's going to give you your actions. It's going to say show pop-up. We're going to set this one to pop-up number one. But when someone clicks the button, it's going to open pop-up number one. So to set up pop-up number one, you're going to go up here and you're going to hit the I. This is going to bring up your pop-up, which is right here. This is on iPad, so it's a little hard to see. First things first, we're going to edit the pop-up. Once you've hit the edit pop-up button, this is going to be displayed in the editing sidebar. Always leave your show close button on. Do not have your pop-up open automatically. This is just annoying. And do not have your pop-up open on exit. Now you can edit this like any other section. You can change your background color, adjust your sizes. So now that we've edited our pop-up and changed the looks to make it look how we want, we can go back to the pop-up itself. We're back to the pop-up editor. So I like to have two because I want a first name and their email address. So we can go here, change this type to first name. It will automatically put that in. You can change color, height, all the cosmetic details. Now this is the most important part of using the pop-up method. Go to your button in your pop-up, hit the gear, and this is going to bring up your actions. You want to send form, that's going to submit your email, and then you're going to want to set this to custom URL. This is where you're going to put your outside affiliate link. So continue this process for all of your pop-ups with all your different links, and this should set your page up nicely. I hope this tutorial was helpful, and if you have more questions, feel free to reach out to me. I'm always happy to help.